However, everybody, my name is Coach Shadogs to One Bob Built for Theme Park News, and welcome to a Theme Park Newsroom update from Chessington World Adventures. Now, on the day of recording, which is the day of uploading as well, today is the annual pass holder preview day. Uh, so, people are going to be down there at Chessington World Adventures, so I thought it would be a good idea to have a look at the 2020 map uh, and sort of notify you on the changes for those of you who are looking to visit. Uh, in the summer or later on in March uh, or anyone that sort of doesn't know the changes that's going on at the resort this year. So before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please share with your friends, family and on social media and make sure you get your questions in. We're almost at 1,500 subs. Use the hashtag question before or after your question in the comments down below. The Q&A will be released a couple of weeks after we hit the milestone. And for now guys, let's get into this video. So... But first of all, before we get into the details, we have some shout. We have a lot of shout outs for this video. So big shout outs go to Theme Park Earth, Thorax Changeling, uh, Falco Flare, Theme Park Kieran, Theme Park Unlimited. Um, also big shout outs to Bobblehead Boy, uh, Slouchy Bike 0143. That's a lot then. <laughs> uh, Tom. Tom Barrett, big shout out to you, uh, Coaster UK, and also Sketch Kids. Uh, so that, my friends, is all your shout outs. If you want a shout out in our next video, then please comment down below. Let's get into this video then. So, on your screen now, Fan Dabit Dorsey. Uh, that, my friends, is the official 2020 uh, Chessington Wall of Adventures map. Um, so that's all, so the map is all there, so um, sort of give you a couple of minutes just to sort of notify the changes, but obviously the main big thing over there is of course the rainforest area, uh, which the re-themed treetop hoppers, the new mini log flume, the main stage, uh, which is a big thing to know, that's part of the rainforest area now. Um, obviously, so that means the Africa area is gone, which we'll talk about in the little details that we're going to sort of share with you. Um, yeah, so that is the uh, map, but then I'm going to put another image on your screen. In fact, I'm going to put it on your screen right now. Find out Bidorzi. Now, this image is sharing you all the details. So, let's talk about it. So, first thing to notice, something is being unearthed in Forbidden Kingdom, uh, where Ramesses Revenge once stood. So, of course, that's for the Drop Tower in 2021. Uh, the Africa area, like I spoke about, has been removed and the main stage is now part of the rainforest area, so the Africa area does not exist anymore. Uh, and I'll get on about the history of that um, in a little bit, just for those of you who didn't know about this area. Dragon's Lair Cafe, uh, located uh, in the Land of the Dragons area, uh, so that's something new for the dining experiences. The Blue Barnacle, which is the brand new version of the Black Buccaneer, is located in Pirates Cove. So that is a brand new pirate system. We're being told it's not manufactured by a Hoss anymore. It's going to be a brand new pirate ship swinging system. Uh, so that is good indeed. Uh, and of course, Vegan Street Dogs, a new food outlet, is located in the Mexicana area of the park. Uh, so, you know, and there's also some stuff about Now TV, I believe, on there as well. So, uh, just little little extra detail that we just note, pick note on. Uh, but those are sort of the main stuff in terms of in-park things. Uh, now, you guys are probably thinking about the Africa area. What was that? What was that area? Uh, well, of course, that contained the Zufari right into Africa uh, attraction. Um, so in terms of the actual, uh, the areas of the park, um, Obviously, it's the end of Africa, replaced by the rainforest. Um, now, if you want to know exactly what else was in the Africa-themed section, which is now the rainforest section of the park. Um, so, you originally had the Toy Town theme, so that was the history. So, it was a small area aimed at families. It had the previous Toy Town theme. Uh, it was home to the Madagascar show in 2012. Uh, there was also um, the stage show on Penguins of Madagascar. Uh, as part of the Year of the Penguins in 2015. Uh, there was also Penguins of Madagascar Mission Treetop Hoppers, which are the Junior Drop Towers, which is now known, of course, um, as Treetop Hoppers. Um, 
You've got Tony's Crazy Cars, of course, that's been changed and rethemed uh, for this year. And of course, you've got the brand new uh, mini log flume in the park as well. So, for those of you who need a bit of uh, catching up on the rainforest area and what this new area uh, includes, uh, so Jungle Rangers, uh, which is the rethemed Tony's Crazy Cars, the new Jeep system. Uh, you've got River Rafts, which is the mini log flume, and of course Treetop Hoppers, which is the renamed and rethemed um, Junior Drop Tower attraction. So massive things going off at Chessington World Adventures this year from all sides of the resort, apart from, obviously the hotel side will probably do some extra stuff as well, uh, but in terms of the theme park side, you've got everything from new attractions, refurbished attractions, uh, closed off areas, brand new areas, uh, and of course brand new dining experiences as well, uh, and refurbished rides as well. So everything's going off this year at Chessington World of Adventures. It's brilliant. And of course, this season all leads up into a big season next year in 2021 with the addition of the brand new drop tower in the Forbidden Kingdom area replacing the old Ramesses Revenge attraction. Obviously, something's being unearthed. So I guess the unearthed kind of gives us some clues of potential theme. Obviously, we knew from the plans that I showed you in a previous video about the crocodile head. Uh, and the fact that it could be a crocodile themed drop tower, maybe being unearthed, maybe they're excavating the bones of this old Egyptian crocodile and like the whole spirit of the animal launches up into the sky and creates this attraction maybe. Uh, who knows? Who knows what the story of this ride is going to be? So we'll have to sort of see with that. Uh, so thank you very much for watching this theme park news from update from Chesterton World Adventures. Please like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now, guys, keep on the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.